right, so I have a special guest with me today. Uh, joining us in the briefing room is actress and multi-platinum recording singer-songwriter Olivia Rodrigo, who traversed red lights and stop times to see us. If you know her music, you'll get that dad jokes there. Um, thing, and we just want to thank you for using your platform and your voice for elevating the important issue of young people getting vaccinated. She's here today to meet with the president and Dr. Fauci later this afternoon, but she agreed to come say a quick hello to all of you first. With that, I'll turn it over to you, Olivia. Hi. Um, first, I want to say I am beyond honored and humbled to be here today to help spread the message about the importance of youth vaccination. Uh, I'm in awe of the work President Biden and Dr. Fauci have done and was happy to help lend my support to this important initiative. It's important to have conversations with friends and family members, encouraging all communities to get vaccinated and actually get to a vaccination site, which you can do more easily than ever before, given how many sites we have and how easy it is to find them at vaccines.gov. Thank you, Jen, for having me today. Uh, and thank you all for helping share this important message. It's so appreciated. Thank you. Okay. Thank you, Olivia, so much for joining us. Good luck with your great day. Olivia visited the White House on Wednesday, July 14 to encourage more young people to get vaccinated against COVID-19. The partnership with Rodrigo is just one of several initiatives the White House has undertaken. Olivia wore a pink skirt suit and paired it with chunky white Jizip Zanoti platform heels, black socks, and a Tinya Minamuti black suede purse. Her pink and black skirt suit is a vintage Chanel from spring or summer 1995 collection.